with the Bulldogs. Let's go Bulldogs. Last week's meltdown caused an outcry from parents. Coach is well aware, vain to get their team back to its family core. After their worst game on the season last week, the Bulldogs look to strengthen their team unity today when they face off against the West Hempstead Broncos. With a season record of one and four, it's an uphill battle every game, but Bulldogs always fight. They start with the ball. Running and running, but with no significant gains. Broncos ball. Starting defense. Come on, man. Matthew, outside of sincere, Matthew. Got a tight end, Nico. It doesn't take long for them to gallop into the lead with a run on the outside. Broncos lead 7-0. Bulldogs trail 7-0 with the conversion. Bulldog blocking is lackluster thus far. They lose the ball, with the Broncos recovering the fumble. Bulldogs are missing vital assignments defensively. The Broncos run again to the outside edge for an easy touchdown. They now lead 13-0 in the first quarter. Yeah, yeah. Oh, <laughs> 
The dogs take possession. The blocking showing signs of improvement. But not good enough for a first down. Broncos take the ball back. Trying once again to reach the end zone. A task that doesn't take long to accomplish. Now lead by 20 points. <laughs> Things get worse for the Bulldogs as they throw an interception on the very next play. Moments later, the Broncos score again as they trot into halftime with a 26-0 lead. Wrapping up at the feet. Everybody else is scared. Mike, this is it. We tell you 16,000 times to go on the outside. You go on the inside, we get beat for touchdowns on the outside because you're not there. Mason, you got a guy right in front of you and you go to the left away from him because you're scared to touch him. I have no idea why. They're 9 and 10. You guys are 9 and 10. I don't care if you're 9 and they're 11. Put a hand on them. Slow them down. Go. Offensive line. Hold their jerseys. Hold their jerseys. I'd rather get some holders on. We're not I want get something. Y'all ain't even trying to cheat. Like, let's do something, guys. You hear that, guys? You're letting Ramel, Julius, Dominic, Nico get pounded in the backfield. You're not even putting hands on these kids. These guys are coming right in, man. 
Right in. It's it's crushing. Defensive end. They crush the defensive end. Defensive end. Your first thing is outside shoulder strike, be on the corner. Quarterback's coming a first threat tackle, right? I didn't see an end in a play yet on that quarterback. I won. They ran outside three times to the quarterback. I didn't see the end there once. What did they do? Strike your man and come up the field. First threat come to you, hit it on the outside. Up, up the field, so not down the line. Every time you're inside, that's what. Right? That's what's happening. You gotta play your spot. Up Mike, the field. Same thing. You gotta not hit him. You the gotta line. strike him. Come up and look for the first threat coming at you. Hit it. Hit it. Guys, well, I yeah, you say yes. You do it two times and then you go back to the old way. When I said you doesn't on the blitz, work. It's 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 Yo, no, one out, job guys, to five do. Games. A blitz, it's a blitz, guys. A blitz isn't read and then go. A blitz is go. And hit the first man. Just go. Just hit the first different jersey. That's all you got to do. Look you for the ball when you get behind the line. Down. You got helmet and shoulder pads on. Guys, stop being scared. You're not even tired right now. You're not even a little tired right now. You're just moping around. That's not good enough. Oh, That's, not good That's not football oh, football. That's not football. My hurts. You're embarrassing hurts. yourself. And then at the end of the game, you guys run around here wild like... You guys didn't even play a football game and everybody's happy and fucking happy. The first time, I don't like this, man. The first time they scored, you guys lost. Not the game, but mentally. Because you think you can't make it back. That's not fighting. You got to fight. We can put you in position to make plays. We can't make it for you. It's got to come out of you. I tell you guys to get an attitude somehow. Get mad. Get aggressive that you're playing another team. They're mad and aggressive that they're playing you. They're telling each other on the field, it's 26 9 And they're like, yo, let's go. We want more. And you guys are just laying down and saying, come into my house, take whatever you want, kick me while you're leaving, stomp me out, stomp out my brothers, yeah, and leave. Bring, bring That's not cool, man. You guys are bugging. Listen, at, from this point on, they got 26, we got nothing. No. Let's play for pride. I need you inside. Too. Don't let them score anymore, right. and let's us start scoring. Whether we win, lose, the point is that we got to win a battle, whether it's pride or a game. One play at a time. That's it. That's Knowing the game is out of reach, they encourage their players to play for pride, the to finish strong. Just touch the guy in front of you and keep pushing him until you hit a whistle. Let's, let's win plays so that way you guys can understand that I don't care if you're 9 and nine and, and, and small 10-year-olds, you can play with other kids. They're 9 and 10. They put their uniforms on just like you do. They're not special. They're not bigger and stronger than you guys, smarter than you guys. But they're playing with their heart because I hear them talking to each other. They want to win this game. You guys just want to come here and get your ass kicked. I don't know. I don't know. Let's play one play at a time. Let's win one play at a time. Individual Let's win battle. Play. Win your individual battle. Battle. It's a different game right here. It's a different hat. Let's come out you here on the get in two lines, and man. get the ball right back to the offense. Win the second. Are you guys half. listening? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Yo, full right. speed, man. Let's go. Full speed. Let's go. Run the coach. Bulldogs defense takes the field first. They come out hitting hard. stopping their offense for the first time today.
defensive tackle Sal Galuccio gets a sack on the QB, pumping his team up. Number 40, Juju Rivera, shaken up on the play, gave everything he had. He is carried off the field for a much deserved rest. Number 87, Sincere Hester, is getting mad, and it's showing on the field. Another sack for his team. Don't let the name fool you. His hits are far from sincere. The Bulldogs were able to keep the second half scoreless after a devastating start. They can hold their heads high knowing that they came together as a team this week. I shut them down the second half. The second half, you guys played amazing. They didn't even get one touch. Go, guys. Listen, it doesn't matter. It's a learning experience. Yo, yo, Probably the most important victory of the year was won today. Strengthening the football family bond. Football is life. Listen, guys, we started off the game horrible. Disgusting. Disgusting. Second half, you guys decided to put your helmets on yeah. and come play football. That's all we asked from you guys. Just come and play. One play at a okay? time. You guys did great in the second half. We finished the game off great. We're going to let those guys score no more points. That's where we at right now. We're at one play at a time. Let's win one play at a time. We win one play at a time, put some plays together, turns into a half. Then we put that half behind us. We keep winning one play at a time, one play at a time, and now we're on to the next game. That's it. I'll put you guys Mikey. in here. Sincere Mikey, you got to understand, when you're at your position and you're on assignment, only two things happen. You guys make plays or they hold you. you. But as soon as you go inside, yeah, we're dead. Try, it's a touchdown. When you guys are outside, yeah, no one can block you. Yeah. But you both have to stay on the side. You gotta do your job. You have to do that. Listen, the second half was a win. Yes. The second half was a win. They didn't score no points. We didn't either, but it's all right. Take that as a W. Zero. Take that as a W. All right? <coughs> on to the next one. We're going to practice on Monday. 
we're still working at what we're working on. We're still working at what we're working on. One play at a time against Limbro. One play at a time against Limbro. And that's it. Great job, right. guys. We put in. a couple Everybody of new up. guys in the new positions. You guys stepped up. Yep. Sal. You seen it? Sally Boy played. My man. Good Sal, up. good job. Aiden Torres, pride captain of the game, and he tore it up today. Kid was hurt. Played with arm hurt. Gave it everything he's got. Only dude making tackles on the big guys in the first half. Second half, everybody came together. We gotta keep it together now. Keep it together. On to the next one. Keep your knee up high, please. And a lot of ice. Bulldogs on three. One, two, three. Bulldogs! Let's go, boys! Okay, let it hair, baby. Let it in. Let's get it.